Hi guys, I've been keeping you hanging for a long time, uh, revealing what new electric unicycles that I actually bought uh, when uh, I lost the old one. I got the package yesterday, so uh, now I thought it would be a good chance uh, to do an unboxing to show you what's inside the package and reveal mo what model I actually chose. And the camera I'll be using today is the Osmo Pocket and uh, I've actually put it into photo mode so if I move a little bit around here it will follow me. So in that way it's a double test so you will get an unveiling of the electric unicycle as well as a test of how good the Osmo Pocket is actually to following the action that uh, I'm doing. Let's unbox! Stickers from Speedy Feet. It was Speedy Feet that delivered this uh, wheel for me and uh, I got some nice stickers. And a brochure, which is pretty nice. There's uh, two fuses, there's a power cord, and a charger. It's an 84 volt charger, and uh, with this connector, you might be able to guess which wheel it is. Da da da! KS18. This is not a big surprise because I actually love my old wheels. Of course, I wanted to do something similar this time. But I took the chance to actually include an upgrade. So this is the KS18 XL, which has a 1554-watt-hour battery compared to the 1000-hour battery in the L version. So um, it will be pretty exciting to see if uh, this wheel is uh, the race for this wheel, how much extra I can squeeze out of it. I have decided to do a separate test, a separate range test. It needs to be a little bit better weather than it is right now to do it. So uh, keep out and uh, keep an eye out on the channel for for a range test like that. Let's uh, take off this wrapping so I can sh I can show you how it looks like because this one actually got black pedals compared to the gray ones that the previous model had. So let's take off this and see if there's actually power on. There's not a big difference between the L version and, uh, and the XL version. Uh, one of the main reasons, uh, or the main differences is, uh, the, is uh, the battery size, as I just mentioned. Ooh, I actually didn't uh, realize that I ordered it in the matte black finish. So, look at this baby, woohoo, with black pedals. There's also another difference is the mud guard, but apart from that, the two wheels are exactly identical. So let's try and fire it up, like that. And uh, I guess it's locked from the factory, so I need to uh, connect the app actually to unlock the wheel. This is typically how it sound, sounds when it's, it's locked. So, and also this, these are also black. So this is a pretty nice and beautiful wheel. I don't want to listen to this, so I turn it off. Okay. So, welcome to the newest member of the family, the KS18 XL. Let's get this uh, wheel fully charged and unlocked. I don't understand Chinese. Woo. So now I unlocked it. Yeah. The wheel is unlocked and ready for some action! So the wheel is connected now and it, that was uh, pretty easy even though I didn't uh, understand much of the user interface uh, because it's in Chinese. But it was uh, relatively uncomplicated uh, to get it uh, up running and I would expect maybe I could change the language. Ah, oh, come on Kingston, how can you deliver a wheel where everything is in, in Chinese for the app? <laughs> yeah. So, very nice wheel, nice black matte finish, uh, black pedals, uh, the side cushions are the same as they were in the previous model, it's the same, it's the same handle, like that. 
the mud guard has been upgraded as I said and uh, yeah pretty much the same wheel. I do want to give a big thank you to uh, Ian Samson from Speedy Feet for helping me out in this uh, difficult situation where I lost my wheel. It was a lot of money for me to get going again so he cut me a pretty fair deal that would allow me to purchase this wheel and uh, of course, uh, I took this uh, opportunity because uh, riding the electric unicycle is such an integral part of uh, my channel. So uh, I couldn't be without a wheel. So uh, if you're interested in uh, the electric unicycle, Speedy Feet also has a YouTube channel. He showcases some of the other types of wheels that he is uh, selling. So I highly recommend that you go and uh, check out his channel, also his uh, web shop for some pretty sweet deals uh, on these electric wheels. It seems there's quite a big interest here on the channel actually to learn more about this way of uh, transportation. So it's a big uh, or a good opportunity to go and check out his stuff. Ian Samson, Speedy Feet. I have links for both his channel and his web shop in the description below. Ali, if you have any specific questions to the KS18 uh, XL, that uh, you want me either to test out or try out, then leave a comment in the comment section below. Also, as mentioned in the beginning of the video, this video has been recorded both sound-wise and video-wise on the Osmo Pocket. So uh, this will also give you a chance to see that uh, you can use this kind of camera as a secondary camera, camera guy if there's nobody around. It's pretty nice. You can do this follow stuff where it actually tracks your face when you're moving around. So. I hope you enjoyed this video and uh, thank you for watching and see you on the next one. <laughs>